It is November the 11th, 2021. I'm Andy, and this is the Menorcan Mullet Report from the Golden Ray Rec Site and the Port of Brunswick. And that's where we're going to start today over the Port of Brunswick in the Mars Group working on Section 5 with that mighty crane Thor on that big derrick barge. And we noticed something today that the section they had suspended is getting shorter. So we were over and had a vantage point where we could see the operation, and it has been getting shorter. While they've been suspending this part of the Section 5, they've been cutting out the decks, and as that happens, they'll cut the decks, let them fall to the deck of the dry dock, and then lower the section down. So this section has been shrinking for the past, I don't know, day maybe. Might not even be that long. This was earlier in the day when we were out getting these shots. And we got a little video. We did a little drone work for you folks. So you, you, I want you guys to be able to see what's going on. And it is really neat how they're managing to... Uh, deal with these these sections or these pieces of the section I should say and how they're swinging them around we can see this this piece they've just finished cutting the decks and it's coming on down and we got called away we had to go away for a little while and when we got back over to the site uh, this section or this piece was actually over on the barge they had already picked it, picked this. They'd gotten it down small enough where they they had it the size they wanted it. They put it around over on the barge that had that bigger section, piece of the Section 5 on it. And then they were welding it down to the deck of that barge. Guys are really moving. And I don't expect that it's going to take these guys very long at all to finish dismantling this section. Uh, they are really moving. Um, it's quite impressive to see up close and personal and hear it uh, as it's happening. It, it is kind of noisy, but it is it's happening quick. Guys are really moving. And you can see uh, the welders here, they're uh, putting on some angled pieces onto this this last piece of uh, the section that we had up, you can see the welders down there welding these these braces in place to hold it, and it's on the barge. And their next step, it appears, is going to be maybe the top section of what's left. Uh, we say that because while we were there, we could see. Uh, some torching that was beginning to happen on the keel side. So what we're thinking is maybe they're going to cut across here and then lift that what's left of, the, uh, of this section onto the barge. Now this is section four. This is the last piece of the, of the golden ray to come out of the water. And this was going on. I want you guys, to, this is kind of sped up. What they're doing is pulling these cars out of this section. They had the big Pacific Derek barge down and what, what we're going to do we just we, this is kind of sped up here but we're going to slow it down and i want you guys to listen to the sound What we could tell from there is uh, while they were pulling that car, it looks like uh, the suspension piece that they had, that cable, broke away. The suspension piece from the car broke away, and it came out, but then the car, it was enough there to, to jar that car loose, and you could hear it falling uh, all the way down that deck uh, to the to the bottom. So 
crazy, crazy things there, and you can understand a dangerous, dangerous operation there. These guys really got to be on their toes for what they're doing. is impressive to watch. Now this next scene, we're back out at the at the wreck site, and these images are courtesy of Unified Command. Uh, we've got these these images from their press release. We can see the claw out fishing and it's pulling up some of those vehicles that are down down in the bottom there around the wreck site. We know there there's quite a bit down there. And it looks like he's he's two for one in here. He's gonna pull up two cars with one bite. Impressive skills here with this operator. They're continuing to get get these these cars and the other debris that is on the floor of the sound up and they're placed on that barge. This operation is expected to continue for a while as, as we think there's quite a bit of this debris down on the bottom of the sand. Do you guys enjoy the car fishing? It seems not only are they having success fishing uh, cars, but they're also finding what appears to be sections of deck and possibly parts of the ship. We're not really sure what these are, but uh, you can see they're they're finding some uh, some other large pieces. And here we can see one here that's pretty large too, coming up uh, from the floor of the sound. And the last image we have here is uh, some of the sonar sites and you can see the amount of debris that's kind of down there so they're working on these areas and trying to get those cleaned up well hey that's about all the time we got for the report today we hope you guys enjoyed it we're going to ask that if you haven't done it yet you'll subscribe to the channel you'll give us a thumbs up maybe keep the comments coming because we do enjoy hearing from the menorcan navy most of all we want you guys to stay safe out there.